In this quick little video, I'm going to show off uh, my new version of Perspectives, which is a Visual Studio extension for Visual Studio 2010, and it manages window configurations in Visual Studio. Eclipse has a similar f uh, functionality, and I thought it was pretty cool, so I, I added it to Visual Studio. And one of the cool things is that it's actually built into Visual Studio, but there's no like GUI for it. So that's pretty much what Perspectives is. It lets you access the API hidden in Visual Studio for this kind of thing. So what a window configuration is, is it's the how the windows are laid out in Visual Studio. So as you can see, I have the Power GUI console open on the bottom here and a Teletrace open on the right side here. If I go up to the Perspectives toolbar, I can click one of my uh, different uh, window configurations. So I'll click that, and it applies that window configuration. You can see that it opened different windows and uh, closed the ones that aren't part of this configuration. On the right hand side here, we have the Perspectives Manager, which is an, a tool window that comes with Perspectives. It lets you see all the different perspectives that are available to you. Uh, the little green check box applies them. Uh, the little heart puts them on the toolbar as a favorite. Uh, you can also save or update the existing con uh, window configurations or delete them. Design, Debug, and No Tool Win are the ones that actually come with Visual Studio and tests I created myself. So to create a new window configuration, you could select you know, an existing one, add a different window to it, like Architecture View in this case, which may take a second to open. So now I have Architecture View open here on the bottom. If I were to click, and uh, it's the Save As button, it pops up this little thing asking for the name. So this is called ArcView. Click OK. Now I have an Arc View available to me. Clicking Design would take me back to the Design view. Cl clicking No Tool Win would close everything. And I could reopen the Perspectives Manager and click Arc View, which reestablishes my Architecture View window configuration. From there, I could delete other window configurations or even add it to my toolbar up here. So that's just a little overview of what Perspectives is and how it's a little bit better than the previous version because it adds this little toolbar. Um, if you have any questions, you can visit my blog at csharpening.net or download uh, Perspectives on the Visual Studio Gallery. Thanks.